Will illumine. Open your eyes. Open them. Well, I, for the life of me, can't understand why a lot of people don't see what's really going on. Have you noticed a lot of things have been dramatized, you know, been blown up way out of proportion? The weather is one of them, isn't it? Well, just take a look at the amount of Femon weather presenters. It's nearly all Femons now, isn't it? I suppose because they look better than the male, maybe. Well, some of them do. But they present the weather and it's, we're all going to die. It's going to be a rain coming down. Stay indoors. Drama. But they bring drama into the government as well. And there's more and more Femons into the government. And when they create all this big drama about nothing, it stops the government from doing what it was supposed to do in the first place. Look after the people. Now we all know that Femons are quite selfish and self-centered. They can't help it, I guess. But when a Femon gets into the government, what do you think they're going to be looking for? They're going to be looking to make the Femons better off. Not the people. The Femons are what they're going to work for. When they should be working for the people, which is the men and the Femons too. And you'll notice that the laws that come in are for the men to obey, not the Femons. And the more and more Femons that get into the government, the more and more this will happen. At the moment, society takes money from the man and basically gives it to the Femon. In a sort of secret type of way. I can't remember of any politician that's a Femon that helped men and brought a law in for men. Well, I could be wrong. Maybe there was one or two. I don't know. So I guess when you vote people, watch how you vote. But of course, men aren't the majority of voters anyway. It's Femons. And just a little while ago, Theresa May left, but just before she left, she brought the upskirt law in, where men can be charged £250 and put into prison. That was her last act as Prime Minister of the UK. And I hope that other people can see this as well, even the Femons out there that are not crazy. Yes, there's quite a few, but they're not as loud as the crazies, are they? The UK is at a precipice right now, and there's quite a few Femons running for Prime Minister. And all that will mean will be more laws against men. More laws for Femons. And they will take a look at the Femon issues, but they will not look at the men's issues. And that's why the majority of men are the people on the streets. The homeless. And he may be on the street because a Femon has taken his house and his belongings and his money. Sanctioned by the courts. The laws. And yes, it's about 37 degrees in the UK where I am at the moment. And I'm still alive. But apparently everybody will die if they go outside and stay out of the water because we'll all drown. Unfortunately, people in the summer drown everywhere, no matter what country. You see, creating drama. You take it easy, fellas. I'm going to have a shower now. Well, why not?